Hi and hello once again. So we are on our uh, tutorial on how we will replace the power supply of this old ah. ES1 model, which is my uh, first PlayStation 1, which I bought 1998-1999. The uh, uh, the reason why it is uh, not. Uh, malfunction is its corresponding power supply so I bought this in uh, in uh, Shopee this a second uh, sec second hand power supply and I already uh, uh, unbox it so that I see that this is the uh, the package so this the uh, uh, power supply that I will install on that PS1 so let's see it will work thank you and subscribe on this channel for more reviews and tutorials. Okay, so let's uh, cut the uh, the portions of this so that you can see the power supply itself so let us little bit uh, the strong call this one with precaution because <laughs> I have a hard time to, uh, to uh, to find a replacement on the power supply okay and here it goes so okay yeah so this is the power supply I don't know what unit it's uh, it, it is belong but what is important is we need to place the power supply of our old unit by this okay it is since it is unboxed let us have the installation see you okay so let us have the uh, uh, installation of this uh, power source here for our ps1 as you can see our model is scph 9001 no? A 120 volt 60 hertz 10 watts uh, NTSC US so you need to unscrew the six screws here this is being uh, illustrated you know, by the arrow signs okay that's will uh, that is uh, our first goal here so we will have our time lapse okay after you unscrew the six screws so all you have to do is to open your PS1 so all you have to do is to pull out like this okay and then now you can now see here your power source so there's two there are two screws here that you need to unscrew okay and as you can see if, it, if the camera sees it uh, this unit was uh, connected to 220 if I'm not mistaken and as you can see here these um, transistors here are burned out as well as this transformer okay so I will uh, unscrew this too and we will use time-lapse okay after you unscrew this power supply your old power supply so please take note of this five pin it must have a five pin here okay for the power source of your unit okay so I already have a uh, uh, a mark here so that I can see that the installation is uh, through that orientation so this is the new power supply and we will do the same process in a reverse order so we will make use of the time lapse again Hi and hello, this is the testing of our uh, unit which is uh, uh, already installed our power supply here. 
so I will uh, zoom it here so this is our PlayStation sorry we have a uh, dim background or black background here so let us uh, push the uh, power button here. so let us see if it is working yes it is already working here very nostalgia in terms of uh, the cell okay hopefully it will uh, push through uh, my unit is a uh, uh, a uh, modified unit okay sorry you know uh, when it's a modified unit it takes a little bit of time no, to, to, to load so yeah the game is already loaded here the game is a um, uh, front mission 3 okay. one of my uh, favorites so we can uh, skip no, some of the loading part here so that we can see the battle here so we can have this one no, cut if necessary so let's wait Oh yeah. Now. You can play some games. Okay. Okay. So again, thank you very much. And see you around on our next tutorial videos I already have some saves here thank you happy gaming okay to see my unit you know that is uh, working on a modified unit so I'll open this one this is the game uh, you can see here a modified unit Thank you.